all right people what's up everyone and welcome to another reaction video for today and i'm here to take a look at the first official trailer for the bad guys which is a new dreamworks animated movie uh which uh they've actually had a lot recently like they had uh, of course they had boss baby 2 they had spirit untamed i think it was called which i think is a spirit stallion of the Semaron. is that what it's called remember that old spirit uh 2d animated movie I don't remember liking it when I was younger, but uh, I think it was supposed to be a part of that. I think it's actually a part of like a, a, a new series based around spirit. I don't know. Um, and uh, the, I heard the Croods 2 is actually really good, but I feel like w they haven't had a really amazing movie since How to Train Your Dragon 2. They've had plenty of movies since, but How to Train Your Dragon 2, I think, was like the last one that was like legit good. So uh, now we have the bad guys, which I'm assuming they're doing kind of like a Zootopia thing here. Because they got like all the typical bag. They got a snake, got a spider. Right? Yeah, it looks like a spider. Got a shark. I think that's a shark. Uh, I think it's just a lizard. I'm assuming. And then a wolf. Uh, so, you know, typical like, oh, you think these are the you know bad. When it comes to animals, you think they're the bad ones. Oh, ooh. spiders are evil. I don't give a shit. No movie will ever, ever, ever convince me that spider. You know, what I'm gonna look right now. Because they're always lingering somewhere, ready to get you. So they're evil. I don't care. Sharks, you can you can argue because sharks are in the water. You know they're not coming in your house and like chilling in the corner of your room waiting for you to sleep. You know, if you're in their domain, they will eat you. Maybe sometimes they don't. I guess. Um, you know, but they always think like, yeah, oh, this is a delicious seal. You know, and they're not thinking, oh, it's a delicious gore. You know. Anyway, a snake. They're evil too, honestly. But snakes are kind of cool. I don't I don't mind a snake. I had a garden snake when I was a kid near uh near my house and uh not bad fellow <laughs> and wolves are kind of like dogs i'm okay and I, we had a iguana when i was a kid too it was a good iguana so i'm not scared of lizards spiders don't go to hell by the way so let's take a look at this i have no idea what to expect i'm sure it's just gonna be what i said zootopia kind of thing maybe they're the bad guys like they 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 rob people and stuff i'm assuming or maybe they're super villains i'm 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 getting like a they rob people vibes from this so let's go Hey, you. Hey, hey you. The Sam oh, Rockwell. I know what it is. You're afraid. Yeah. Because I'm the big bad wolf. Ooh. The villain oh. of every story. Duh. And this is the Oh, I like the animation. Mr. Tarantula. Mr. Shark. Mr. Piranha. Mr. Snake. Piranha, okay. No, nah, Piranha suck. We're the bad guys. It's crime time, baby. Shark. We need a distraction. Do I, get to I like the animation so far. I like the thick black lines and stuff. I'm having a baby! <laughs> <laughs> we were never given a chance to be anything more than criminals. But these are the cars we've been dealt, so we mm -hmm. might as well play them. Okay, that was right. Here, let me help you. Are you okay, ma'am? Thank you, dear. You're such a good boy. <laughs> what? <laughs> <I'm a bad guy. laughs> All right. That's what I love you. Welcome, brother. So I was a good boy. Yeah. You ever wonder what it'd be like if the world wasn't scared of us? Never gonna happen. Guys, we're gonna go good. Did you get hit on the head? Mm -hmm. You villains have an image problem. You need a makeover. So I know. Well, there goes our street cred. What was that I'm voice? Being an outcast. Maybe I don't want to be really like the animation. Bad guy. You don't think I have to choose between your friends or the good life. They're the only friends I've ever had. You have a chance to write your own story. What have you got to lose? I don't know. My dignity? <laughs> yeah, well, <laughs> that ship has already sailed. So you're a rough guy. I can't be a rough guy. That is an animal testing lab with helpless guinea pigs. I'll rescue them. You've never volunteered <laughs> for anything. Mm, yummy. Yes. Oh. <laughs> Come on, Snake, open up. Relax. <laughs> These doors are complicated. <laughs> We're supposed to save them, not eat them. Well, I'd uh, say they've got to a better way. place. That, are you kidding me? I really like the animation. All right, I'm kind of, I'm kind of digging the animation like a, a little bit too much. I mean, the humor itself. Typical kid stuff. Not not really winning me over completely there. I mean, I could see through the trailer. I've said this multiple times with, with like, 
more child oriented movies, I guess, you know, like ones that want to bring in the kids, uh, that they, uh, they really, really, really hammered in the, the, the really lame humor for the most part. I will say though, like the humor is not terrible in this, but they always hammer it in for the trailers. And when you see the movie, usually it's like, it's better presented, I guess, better delivered humor, um, than what the trailer made it seem like, you know what I mean? Uh, so I could kind of see through that and I could see like this movie might actually be pretty good, but the animation, I actually love that part at the end. This, like, I loved a lot of the little piece of animation, but like this right here is really cool. I like how like they have like speed lines and stuff. It almost reminds me of, uh, the, the Pixar movie coming out, Turning Red, that tries to, like, it almost has like an anime influence, uh, around its animation. Just a little bit, like a tinge of that. And there's like a little bit of 2D in here, which is cool. Like, can I go back to the beginning? There was like one part that was really cool. Where are they? Uh, I think they come into the door. So, all right here. That, that's good. That's a good dude. That looks like straight up concept art. You know what I mean? Like, you know how you see concept art sometimes that just want to represent what the movie could look like. That looks like straight up concept art. Concept art. You're afraid because hey, I like Sam Rockwell, obviously. And, she, and the, the snake is a uh, right there. Look. Look at the thick outlines and stuff. That's so good. I love that. I actually really dig the animation. I think it's the most unique looking DreamWorks animation in a very long time. So, you know, shout outs. Shout hey, shout outs to both Disney and DreamWorks, which I think DreamWorks is universal. Did it say that? It probably said it in the beginning. Um, or maybe it says it at the end. Wait, let's see. Yeah, it says it right there. Um, I'm sorry. Uh, for doing something different with their animation. Like, uh, cause even Disney, when it comes to like, uh, recent movies, like, t uh, turning red, but even Luca, I guess these are both Pixar movies to be fair, not just Disney, but, uh, Luca, uh, like had a very different look to it too. Like to compare it to other Pixar movies, like the humans look different and stuff. And just like, it almost looked kind of, I don't know, like it, it looked more cartoony than usual. Does that make sense? Even though they're all cartoony, I, I don't know. Anyway. Um, I will say regular Disney, that's where you get like, kind of like Encanto, even though it looked great, looks similar to other, you know, animated movies like Raya though, from what I've seen of Raya looked really good, but not, I would say any different than most Disney animated movies, or at least not enough to really consider it. Still need to watch Raya. Uh, I thought Encanto was really good though, but uh, anyway, this looks like it could be legit good. So again, the humor, I'm going to base the humor around it being a trailer for kids it's again directed towards kids they're releasing this right before spider-man so i'm sure you'll see this trailer before spider-man where there's gonna be a lot of kids watching spider-man also um but i really like what i'm seeing so yeah and it's a generic story bad guys oh it's called the bad guys and it's an anime movie they're gonna turn to good guys at the end yeah i mean i'd rather like same thing with like despicable me i rather i rather it'd be about a bad guy and they stay bad throughout, but maybe they have some redeeming factors about them, which I guess you could argue this with me is kind of like that, but uh, I'd rather it just be about villain. Yeah. We don't get too many movies about villain. Look, look at Megamind. That, that's like the shining example, I think, of, of Megamind. They advertise that so much like, it's a villain, he's an evil villain, he's a bad guy, and then he becomes a good guy. Um, <laughs> spoilers for Megamind, if you couldn't see that coming, but uh, I like Megamind. My, me, 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 me. I like Mega Mind also. Didn't Mega Mind become like a meme for a little while? Like, I don't even think it was like super popular when it first came out, but I think, I think it became a meme for a little while. Anyway, the bad guys looks good. Actually, I'm, I'm surprised. I am super surprised because I wasn't expecting anything. 